Yo, what's going on everybody? We're back with another video. Today, we're gonna be talking, this is perfect, MLB Field of Dreams program just came out. So it's actually 11 p.m. for me. I pretty much just got home. Um, this be this week's gonna be super, super busy for me. So I kinda know what some of these cards are, are in the programs, but I don't really know. And I'm just gonna film it, you know, talk about what I feel about this stuff. Oh my God, Chris Bryant, what the fluff? Can I buy these packs? Are they even worth it? Okay, hold on. We're gonna go through these cards real quick. Hold on, I'm blocking them. Boom. All right, Mike Piazza. We're going over his card first. What the fluff? Yo, this Piazza's endgame. 116, 125 contact with 113, 119 power. He sells for 120K. Of course he does. Lefty Grove. Uh, we got a fastball. We have a cutter. That curveball and changeup have a huge, huge... Um, and he has outlier. Oh my God. Um, the curveball has a huge drop off. That could be like an insane, insane card. We have Mike Schmidt, um, 96 fielding, really, really good, really, really solid. Could definitely be end game. 93 contacts, a little low, little low, little low. We would want something a little bit higher, but that's not the end of the world. This Chris Bryant MVP card, I hit so well with Chris Bryant. I'm definitely gonna use this guy, and we're gonna see how good he is because that card looks absolutely insane. Lou Brock, obviously, we don't really care about. Not really ever gonna try him. Super low on power. No, thank you. Jim Palmer, sinker, fastball. I mean, throws a really slow curveball. I don't really care about that. Paul Konerko. Not a bad if if you're a Chicago White White Sox fan. Not 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 a bad card, but definitely nothing crazy. Batances actually gets a card. He only has a slurve. Should I buy a pack? I think I might buy a pack in this video. I'm very interested about that. I actually might buy a pack in this video. White Sox online and Yankees on. Though that's kind of cool. Plus you get 16 if you win five games. Okay, so what do I get? Legend Batskins? Uh, Tom, are you good? I mean, fastball slider, uh, I guess. Brooks Robinson, are you good? Uh, uh, Felix Hernandez. Oh my god, you have a sinker, slurve, cutter, change up fastball. You might be really, really solid. Interested. Roberto Clemente. I don't really care about this card. I don't really care about this card. I mean, this is cool. This is cool. This is cool. I'm not, you know, I, I may sound like an absolute hater, but this is definitely cool. Um, and you get that Field of Dreams pack, but I more care about, yeah, those, these people. Um, just went into the, uh, event, forgot they had an event. Um, you can only use, what's it called? So you can only use Legends, White Sox, or Yankees players, which, you know, we got a decent team. We got to go to, we got a really go to team anyways, but the rewards, I forgot. They do give you rewards. Silly mother fluffing me. Um, so first we get DJ LeMayhew, which 100 power versus lefty is not bad. That really good contact. The only thing is he doesn't have 80 power. I think people have said is the threshold where if you get a perfect, perfect fly ball, I think they've said he should hit a home run. They're not saying he will hit a home run, but you should if you have 80 power, I think. I don't know. Lucas Giolito. I mean, fastball, change, slider, curve, only four pitches. Eh. eh will I be playing the event? Maybe. Maybe. Um, That was kind of quick. That's just kind of how I feel about that. The World Series rewards. The Justin Verlander could possibly really be end game pitcher wise. I mean, he's going to throw 102 mile per hour fastball. Then he's going to throw a curve or circle change at 80 miles per hour with a cutter and a slider. So he's kind of crazy. Francisco Lindor is definitely end game. This, this dude will be my shortstop. This Francisco Lindor 1000% is going to be my shortstop. And he's from Puerto Rico, which I'm going to put on back on the Puerto Rico jerseys at some point. Probably when I get him, the Puerto Rico jerseys will go back on. That's probably going to be my guy. All right. I think we're going to end it off with, with a pack. Hopefully we pull Piazza um, if we don't. Then we're just sad. We didn't. Okay. Um, we're just going to take Chris Bryant because we wanted him anyways. We just paid a little bit extra for Chris Bryant. So if you guys don't really care about the program now, which you guys have already should have seen the program, but that's just my thoughts about it. Next, I guess I'm going to talk about like why I'm so busy. So my aunt and uncle own a farm and we're selling corn and I'm helping with the process of selling that corn. So that's what I'm doing like during the day and stuff. I'm not playing MLB as much. For like the next two weeks or so you know i've just been busy i've been i've been super busy i'll be super busy this this week i'll be super busy next week um so i should have videos out to you guys i did miss a video last yesterday but that's why i ended up posting two today yes sir i just want to talk about that also i did just release a justin turner debut today earlier check that video out because that video justin turner goes off justin turner might even be on my team the rest of the year because he is honestly fantastic he plays so much better than his stats i was only playing in hall of fame or all-star difficulty not legend yet obviously i haven't made world series check out the one i posted today and then 
we'll have more gameplay of Justin Turner in general. So, yeah, really, really awesome. Anyways, if you guys enjoyed that, go ahead and hit that subscribe button for your boy, and I'll catch you guys next time. Peace.